Hey, Tracy Beaver here again with Beaver Maintenance and Construction. Right here, I was gonna show you my new 100 Mini X. I was fortunate enough to, to find this machine after finding the Teleskid, and uh, I was looking to buy a machine because, hey, I made too much money last year. We had to spend some money because I was more profitable by using the right equipment. So I asked Joey to bring this on out, let's try it out. And the day that I tried out this machine, I tried seven brands all side by side. I set my butt in every single one of them. And I narrowed it down to three, and then I narrowed it down to one. This machine is was faster and very versatile. I was using a different brand, and I had two skid steers running, putting the dirt in the hole, and I was cutting a knoll so that I could test it in our good hard clay pan soil that we have here. And when I say hard pan, I mean hard pan. It's just like concrete at times when it dries up. And I had a smaller bucket on this machine at the time than the other brands. And this machine would dig faster and maneuver faster than the other machines. I had two skid steers delete my pile of dirt that I had cutting out for them to put in the hole. And I caught back up and piled up dirt with this machine. And that was a huge thing to me. We are fortunate enough that we have a nice cab, comfortable seat, lots of room. Some of those machines that I looked at, that was a big issue. Not near enough room in the cab. And one machine was a very good machine. I liked the machine a lot, but the biggest downturn, I couldn't fit in the cab. I'm not a small guy. I've never seen many dirt guys that were small guys, to be truthful. We all sit in that machine all day long and run run our machines and you know we don't get the exercise we once once did. But that's beside the point. This machine to me, for the money, it's hard to beat. Uh, as you can see, I had a thumb installed on this machine to be able to pick out trash. I don't have time to get out and grab trash, move it out of the way. When you're digging out hills, you'll find that there's always tree roots and things of that nature with a thumb on this machine. It made it very versatile for me to be able to pick up the big pieces of wood and throw them to the side. And as you saw earlier, it was a concrete form left behind, didn't know it was in there, and I was able to throw it out of the way and get it out of our way. Briggs JCB was my dealer on this machine, just like my Teleskid, and they've been really good about taking care of me when I have a problem. And to be truthful, I really hadn't had any problems with this machine, and I'm looking forward to putting a lot of hours on this machine.